Hey, I've got mail, and take a look at this. One of the pieces came all the way from Hawaii. T. Hello, Silver fans. This is T, and you're in a place to be for silver education, acquisition, and entertainment. And uh, yeah, hey, I got some mail, and so uh, I want to show you what I got. And so here we go. I'm going to uh, not waste any time. We're going to get right into this. And here we go. This is another one of my uh, T-mail videos. And uh, if you'd like to see more, uh, I learned how to create playlists. Just today, I learned how to make playlists. So you can go back and take a look and uh, binge watch on my Libertad coins or my other Mexican coins or silver stacking philosophy or of course, my T-mail, and you never know what it's going to be uh, when you open that P.O. box, uh, it, and that's what makes it fun. So here we go. It's like a, yeah, there's a sticker there. Let me read this first. Uh, Hi, T. Love your content on Mexican coins. Hey, thank you. Uh, I have several silver and gold. Just, pick up, just picked up a 1950 25 centavos. Uh, 0.30 AG. Ooh, I would love to see that. I grew up in South Bend. Very nice. And uh, South Bend is a nice place to be, especially if you are a fan of the Notre Dame Fighting Irish, as I am. And I've been to many games and had a lot of fun there. And there's something on the back of this. Oh, all right. Very nice. Thank you very much. It's a Barber Dime, but let's see what year I could tell from the back. It's a Barber. Oh, boy, good job, yeah. 1911. So thank you uh, to this person. And let's see what else. Oh, here's a sticker number nine. Let's see who this, uh, let's reveal who this is. Huh. Death from below. Oh, my goodness. Uh, let me take a look here. Uh, the person didn't sign this, um, so I don't know if they want their name revealed or not. I'm just going to say it's from uh, BW, so thank you, BW. I appreciate the Barber Dime to add to my stack, and I, I really appreciate uh, the sticker, and I like the design. Uh, I'd love to, it may be in the comments, you could tell me a little bit about uh, what the meaning is, death from below. What is that? It looks like some... Uh, fish there. Interesting. So I'm looking forward to the backstory, and uh, that is a cool sticker to add to my collection. As you can see there, it's growing. Well, let me just put this over here, and I go on to the next one. Uh, the next one, as I mentioned, uh, is all the way from Honolulu, Hawaii. And uh, those of you who are uh, serious stackers, uh, and serious YouTube watchers like I am. Boy, I watch a lot, and it's just a nice pastime. Uh, keeps me off the streets, out of the bars, and everything else, and it helps me learn about the silver stacking lifestyle, the community, and uh, wow, let's see what we got here. T the Silver Stacker, here's some swag for your collection. Thank you for your friendship and support. Take care and stay safe. All the best and aloha aloha stacker uh, a guy oh hey look at this what is that let me see if i can get this out we'll figure it out okay had to use the scissors there and let me take a look here now before i even get to this uh, let me just tell you that aloha is a guy like me who absolutely loves libertads and I have been concentrating on the uh, one ounces, but boy, he has a beautiful variety. So if you like Libertads, and I have a feeling a lot of people who are subscribers to my channel do, uh, definitely check out Aloha. And let's see, what is this? One tenth ounce, a guinea. 999 silver so uh, i'm not familiar with this one it's silver obviously and i'll have to get my magnifying glass out to uh, read a little bit better 
uh, the uh, T's eyesight isn't what it used to be. Uh, but uh, hey, aloha, I appreciate this. I look forward to doing a little more research on it. Feel free to leave a comment if uh, and let me know what, what exactly this is and the history, uh, and I'll do my research as well. So hey, thank you, aloha. But I, um, I'll put this, let's see, we'll put it right here. We'll get this out of the way. Let me take a look at these <laughs> awesome aloha stacker with a volcano. Very cool. I love it. And that'll go there. And a couple other varieties here. Well, this, this is a magnet. This will go. See, uh, right now I am um, broadcasting uh, and creating this video for to share throughout the world in uh, T's Silver Cave. And uh, this will go on the refrigerator in the Silver Cave, uh, which is, of course, stocked with uh, some refreshments. Uh, Aloha Stacker. Oh, man, he's a Ford man just like me. Right on. Glad to see that. And uh, the one with the uh, holograph. Very cool. And uh, those will be uh, treasured additions to my sticker collection, which is growing a little bit here. Okay, last but not least, uh, I've got this one here. So, uh, so this is from a viewer uh, with the initials MH. And uh, he says, enjoy. I look forward to seeing what this is. Let's see. Uh, I don't want to reveal any names because uh, just because. So I, like I said, I, I really uh, wanted to try to be careful about uh, revealing uh, names. Uh, so I am going to try to very carefully uh, pull this out without revealing any names here. And whoa. See what we have here. Oh my gosh. Holy smokes, this is really cool. Complete set of current Mexican coins through one peso in use since currency devaluation of 1949. So, wow, you've got the one cent wheat, the one cent Josefa Ortiz, uh, 10 cent Benito Juarez, and oh, 20 cent Tehuatihuacan. Uh, I've actually been there. Uh, I've actually uh, stood on uh, the uh, Pyramid of the Sun, uh, looking in the direction of the Pyramid of the Moon. I've been there. It's uh, in. Uh, it's just absolutely amazing. Um, wow. Oh my God! Look at this. Fifty Cent, Guatemoc, and very cool. I, I have showed in a previous vi version or a video the uh, silver version of this but wow i didn't even know this existed and uh, there you go the one peso patriot jose maria morelos and wow let's look at the backs of these look at that man oh man i'm gonna you know what i'm gonna get a frame for this and put this up. This is really, really cool. This is going to be uh, a, a really nice addition uh, to uh, my collection and something to cherish. So, uh, MH, uh, thank you. Thank you very much. This is really, really cool. I love it. And I'm going to put that right there. And uh, this is one of those, but wait, there's more <laughs> moments. And let me see here. Uh, I won't without revealing uh, the name. I just want to. I hope you enjoy. Thank you, and uh, M H. Thank you. I I really appreciate it. And you didn't have to. You know, not nobody has to send me anything. Honestly, at this crummy time of the year, when it's cold in the Midwest where I'm located, and uh, with the uh, you know everything we we've been dealing with and not being able to go out and socialize and hang out and have beers with friends like uh, you know I normally do on the weekends. We've just all been just kind of uh, stuck in our homes around here. Um, many of my friends uh, have elderly parents and you know we just don't want to spread germs. Uh, this um, silver community has been so great and like I said you don't have to send me anything. Uh, everything I receive is very much appreciated uh, but um, not necessary. Uh, but it, it really is cool to see some of this stuff uh, come in the mail and uh, just to brighten up a Saturday afternoon. So let's see what we have here. 
Oh, here, this must be the note. This is like the gift that just keeps on giving. Gee, what? There's that, there's that, there's that, there's that. Oh my gosh, I don't... <laughs> I wonder what's in here. Let's see. This is going to be interesting. Oh, wow. 1960 peso. And look at that. Estados Unidos Mexicanos. Un peso, 1960. And very cool. And, you know, it says 10% right there. Does that mean it's a 10% silver content? And uh, 0.0514 ounces. So, MH, thank you once again. And, gee whiz. Oh, here's another one, 1958. Same thing. And uh, very cool, very cool indeed. And then I'll go up there for now. And uh, there's two more. Uh, here's another one, very cool. Wow, look at that, 1959. So uh, 58, 59, 60. And let's see what this is. Oh, very nice. Look at this. Estados Unidos Mexicanos. And there it is. Uh, 20 centavos, 20 cents. And very, very cool. Wow. Uh, I really am blown away uh, by the generosity of uh, folks that watch my channel. And uh, it, it is quite a pleasure to make these videos. I enjoy it. This is fun for me. And I'm glad that, uh, you know, some people around the world, uh, whether it's uh, in, in a neighboring state or in Hawaii or in Guam or Sweden or around the world. Uh, MH is from uh, a neighboring state. And uh, so I, I want to say thank you. Thank you for that. And uh, I, I'll do my best to keep making these videos uh, and hopefully uh, providing a few minutes of entertainment for you in, uh, you know, it's uh, time to check out of the crazy world that we live in and uh, relax a little bit and uh, watch some content uh, created by a fellow stacker here in Indiana. And uh, we can uh, enjoy this stacking journey together. So, hey, I'm going to leave it with that right there, guys. Uh, thank you for your generosity, everybody. And thank you for watching. Uh, I really appreciate it. And uh, I hope all of you have a wonderful weekend. T and here's a couple other videos that you might enjoy watching. Check them out.